life has changed a lot. The girls chase me down the street. It's, it's really something. I've been here now since January, the middle of January, and I've gone from in weight. I've, I've gone from uh, 195, and I'm presently at 175. So I've lost 20 pounds, and I got muscles now, which I didn't have. In fact, you can see them. And before that was just flat, but now there's a bump there. <laughs> so I don't know if it's because he's been hitting me or if I've been doing the good exercise. <laughs> when I came in, I, I could just barely do five sit-ups. And now I'm doing 50. And that's fantastic because I, I couldn't hardly move. And almost every exercise that we do, I was very, I was struggling to get it done. And now I'm doing it quite easily. And the only thing is, uh, Mike keeps moving me up to tougher stuff all the time. But now I, I'm getting it to the point where I can do it easier. Well, when I first started on the rowing machine, I thought, boy, this is going to be great. Cause I, it looks like when everybody else was rowing, you know. And uh, when I first started, it was very difficult for me. I didn't realize it was going to. But on the other hand, I picked up on that exercise very fast. And now I can row as good as anyone in the club. The fact is I can beat Mike. I guess I, I rowed for 5,000 meters, okay? The other day, Mike and I went outside. It was a nice day and we went outside and uh, we jogged, I did. And, and Mike tried to run, but he couldn't do it. And so, therefore, I had to carry him. But anyway, I, I did uh, run. I don't know how far that was, I'm trying to think. But it was uh, at least five miles. At least five miles. I think it's uh, two and a half miles one way and then two and a half miles. <laughs> yes, well, I can tell in my body, in my lungs, uh, the, the improvement I've had. It be, when I first came in, if I, I did something like uh, sit-ups or, or jog or walk about, oh, maybe five seconds, <laughs> maybe 20 seconds, but we, we uh, don't have any problem doing it for five, five minutes now. I can take a real deep breath. I look forward to this, and I didn't the first couple of months, but now he's got me to the point where I can do most of the things he's asking me to do quite easily. So, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm enjoying it now. I look forward to this. Yeah, that's why I keep coming back, because yeah. I can see the gain that I'm getting, and my mental attitude has changed, and I look forward to it. It's a, a regular thing that I've got to do every uh, five times a week, and uh, I look forward to it. When I was... Uh teaching at the at college or university level, uh, I would be notified by the academic dean or dean of students that uh, uh, one or two or three of my students in one or more of my classes uh, were disadvantaged and that uh, I should uh, give special consideration and even though I really understood the issue it irritated me that uh, for whatever reason not to expect the best out of those people and I had a negative reaction to that in, in the sense that uh, when the time came, I did probably just the opposite of what the, what was expected of me to do. And, and uh, I respected them, irregardless of their disadvantage, and expected of them. And it never failed that at the end of the course, when it was over with, all that paid off. And I think that same thing applies to taking somebody like Mr. Green, who at 86 years old uh, had a hard time even walking. Uh, 
uh, and on a daily basis, um, really have respect for him as an individual, uh, what he can do, and what I expect of him. And that has paid off because he is a changed individual. Uh, he's got more confidence. I made him try things he wouldn't want to try. And at the end of the workout, he's always exhausted, exactly what I want done. And uh, uh, I'm happy I'm taking that approach.